welcome or welcome back to my channel. Do you want to say hi? If you have read the title, then you probably know what this video is going to be about. This is Leo. I am so excited to share with you guys. He is three months. He's going to be four months soon me and caesar have adopted a puppy and we have named him leo he came into our lives recently i just wanted to introduce you guys um to our new little baby child he's very bitey and everything so i'm gonna take you on this adventure of having a puppy and doing all the things <gasps> ow Two more shots left before he can do his regular like outside outings and go to the park and all that stuff But I do take him to work with me right now He's staying at my parents because me and Caesar are actually in the middle of packing two big life updates We have adopted Leo. The other one is that we are moving <laughs> So it's pretty chaotic in my apartment right now. I'm doing a whole separate moving vlog series for you guys and we're also going on a little road trip very soon so it's just like crazy times but i thought i would start this we got a puppy vlog we've had him for i think two weeks now let's cue the clips of getting leo taking him home and doing some errands for him We're not sure. We're gonna do a DNA test, so that'll probably, if you would like to see that, that could be a separate video. I'll show you. Here. He is getting like trained with um, going outside, which helps because my parents have a yard. So we've been trying to get him to go outside, which he has been doing a great job, but just in case, we also have pee pads in here. He's teething so much. I got him this one, um, and this, I put peanut butter. It helps with his gums, but he's liking that one. <laughs> He knows some tricks already. I don't know how big he's going to get. He might be a medium-sized dog because his legs are pretty long. Leo, sit. Sit. Good. Mano. Mano. Good boy. Don't bite me. Good boy. Those are some of the tricks that we know, right? If you're new to my channel, I hope you subscribe. There's so much puppy dog content coming, so much moving content coming, like so many things are happening this month of August. So this was not exactly planned. He kind of adopted us, literally fell asleep in my lap. We did choose the name Leo or Leo. It's both like Spanish and English. I'm not allergic to him, which was something that was really important. We're so excited to get him groomed, but since he doesn't have all his vaccines yet, we're holding off on that and we're just going to try to cut his hair ourselves and give him a bath ourselves this week. So I'll keep you updated and we'll show you. It's so cute. Like when we brought him home, he was in love with his bed. We don't exactly know the story fully, but he was a stray or somebody dropped him off with him and his sister and his sister already got adopted as well. He's like a baby child. He's literally like a baby child. He's super fluffy. I don't know. I don't know if this is poodle because it's not like fully curly. Like I don't know. But his legs are so long. I think he's going to be a medium size, but I don't know. He has little pink toe beans with little black marks. Which little black marks? <laughs> this is him in a nutshell. <laughs> He loves to be cuddled, he loves to just lay down, he loves attention, and yeah, I'm so excited to take him for walks and stuff because we haven't been able to do that and like go outside, take him to the park, take him to the dog park and stuff. He really needs to groom, but you can tell his paws are super long. You need to groom. Say hi. Say hi to the peeps. Say hi to the peeps. 
little fluffy band. A little cute angel. Do you want to say hi? He likes the camera. Okay, we fogged it up. Okay, little mini unboxing for Leo. We ordered some things, really just two things because we're gonna give him a bath today, which is very exciting. It's his first bath, so I'm excited. We're also gonna cut his hair, so we purchased this one is all professional pet electric clipper. So this is for cats and for dogs. Broke it, but we opened it. <laughs> this is what it looks like. It comes with this little comb with these scissors. And these are just like the instructions. And then this right here is the one we chose. They have different colors too. We picked like a dark blue. And it has a little brush right there. And then, I don't know what this is actually, but it has different um, options. And then this is the charger. So I'm actually going to charge it right now since we're going to cut his hair. And then the shampoo that I picked that I found on Amazon is this one. This is by Tropic Clean. This is a gentle coconut hypoallergenic puppy and kitten shampoo. So it's paraben free and dye free. I will link both of these things down below. Okay, we're going to try to give him this to distract him. See it? Here, then Mantel, aquí, Ale. Uh, have him sit on this tarp. Here, sit, sit, sit. sit. Good boy. Okay. Oh, if you can't get tired of this, something to say what do you have to say leo would you hire us who leo or someone else <laughs> wow he water I, I, I think he has water in his paws he kicked him and he got him wet oh. he is so excited leo look look at that fresh cut we still need to practice some more but it's like your first bath so today is much later, it's a different day, but ooh, shine bright. Like a diamond? Like a diamond. Today's a different day. I'm filming two vlogs at the same time, like a movie vlog and the whole puppy vlog. So this, this is gonna be interesting, just like hopefully I won't mix anything up. But right now we're gonna go to the bank and then we're gonna go to Pet Food Express. So I thought I'd take you along and let's go to Pet Food Express. Okay, we're here. Let's go. 
We're in the treats aisle. So I used to, well, I got him with these last time. He does like them, but to change it up, we're gonna grab these. I have duck. We'll see how he likes it. We're looking at the toys. The biggest Kong ever. Ooh, Versace right there. Yeah. Not this Versace, is his Sachi. Sachi from San Diego. It's my cousin's dog, but I don't know. I'm thinking of a Kong or something like this where he can get entertained because I don't know. So many little haul. We got these small bites for treats. These are the duck ones. Then we got these brushless toothpaste. Four in one cleaning dental chew. So we'll see how he likes them. And then this little frog, Robert, you can put treats in there so that he gets entertained. And then he'll try to have to like take it out and stuff. So got these three Robert. things. Yeah, it is, huh? Robert frog, frog Robert. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I thought this was good for his size. So it should be fine. But yeah, got these three things. And then we got him a big, gigantic bag of food because the original one that we have, he likes it, but they didn't have it. So we're going to try. This is the same brand. We're going to try this one out. And if we don't, like, if he doesn't like it, we can always return it and get our money back or, or store credit, I mean, and then we can still use it. So it's fine. And they also donate it to um, shelters and stuff if we don't use it and return it. So, yeah, it'll work out. What you got? What you got? What you got? Oh my god. Look at what you little spoil. Ow, you're scratching me. Look at this. You got a new yard. He keeps eating the little like things that are under here. Like the little wood pieces. So my dad <laughs> went and got more turf to cover everything. And look at this. You little spoiled. You little spoiled. You like it? Is there more in there? Yeah, I think so. Go play with it. Stay. 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 Dame la mano. Dame la mano. 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 Stay. Mano. Mano. Good boy. Mano. I think he's good, baby. <laughs> good boy. Go, get it. Good boy, Leo. Sorry, I try to get fancy. Leo's learning Muertito, which is like play dead. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ven, aquí. Okay. Sit. Down. Down. No. No, Leo. Sit. Down. No, no. Down. Muertito. Good. Yes. He's, he's, so he's staying smart. there because he knows I'm, that's what I'm asking for now. Yeah. Yo no hay nada. You know? Pizza. Yo no tengo nada. Tell him, Megan. Tell him, Megan. Muertito. Muertito. <laughs> yes. All right. Now we have to do like a. He knows. Huertito. Like it's kind of like a oh, huertito. Okay. That's what I saw in the no. video. That's what I think. I saw TikTok teaching me all these doctors. Huertito. Huertito. Yes. Is he so excited? I have cortisone cream on my legs and he's trying to lick them. Well, it is a different day. I've been doing some work from home today and I'm at my parents. I've been spending the whole day with Leo. What are you looking at, huh? Do you guys think he's getting bigger? I'm not sure. He's waiting because, let me show you. I make him these, I rub peanut butter on this bone that I got him. So I actually put this in the freezer. I don't give it to him right now, but I do let him lick 
like this i'm probably just gonna put some on his little teeth bone and just for this now and then this will be for tomorrow um when i take him to work and i just like to freeze it because he's teething and he just is biting everything he knows you're not getting this today this is for tomorrow leo it is for tomorrow so we're gonna put it in the fridge For now, I'm just gonna rub a little peanut butter on this because he's been very picky about these like little teeth bones that I've gotten him. Um, and he like used to eat them a lot in the beginning, but now he doesn't really. Come. He knows to go. Go on the towel. Sit. Good boy. Here you go. <laughs> he got peanut butter on his nose. He got a couple little gifts, which was really nice from work. Um, he got this cute little fall fox from um, Jethro, who he played with yesterday. I will insert the clips in a little bit, but um, his owner actually gave us this little toy. She also gave us this little um, lollipop, but I think we're going to save this for when he gets a little bit older. So I think I'm going to hold off on this one for now, but it's like a little um, super chewer. This is where we keep like all his stuff since he's staying over at my parents right now. And then this is the little bag that I use when I take him to work. He has been using some pee pads, but not really. He only uses them at work now. He hasn't been using them in my parents' place anymore. And then this is the shampoo I think I showed you guys. Um, my mom just just grab this little like basket thing and I just put all his stuff there um, until we move he also got this one for my job these are the teeth dental treats that he's been having he has been liking these a lot recently these brushless toothpaste which I'm really happy about because they have the toothpaste um, on it so we have a lot of poopy bags and stuff very minimal because once we're in our new space we'll have like or designated thing and like he'll have his designated basket and stuff i am so tired um last night i went to the carol g concert which i loved that'll be probably a separate vlog but i did vlog that as well and i just loved it so much tomorrow is going to be wednesday and i signed up leo for puppy class which i'm very excited about yesterday at work um one of my coworkers brought in their dog his name is jethro he's a labrador retriever he's actually a pet assisted therapy dog and he's like one of the most like gentle giants that there is out there leo had not met any like older bigger sized dogs really he's only met like a small one or two dogs really um because my mom will doggy sit but that's about it so i wanted like his first big dog to be like you know like a calm dog that i would trust and i really trust jethro he's like amazing so my coworker brought him to work yesterday and him and leo had a little like meet up kind of thing in one of the yards at work um that's just indoor and so it was really really nice it was so cute so i'm going to insert the clips now yeah leo go those little clips i think they did so well and they were so cute leo was a little bit scared of jethro i think it was totally fine but it was nice to know that like he didn't like 
you know react in a bad way so i really want to get him used to like large dogs and stuff but tomorrow is wednesday and he has a puppy class i signed him up for just like a one-time puppy class just for him to get some energy out and also just like social um thing since right now i can't take him for walks or anything like that he's mainly at home or at my job i'm gonna take him to puppy class tomorrow so i'm gonna grab some clips of that i did also teach him a few tricks he knows how to sit, he knows how to lay down, he knows how to give your hand and your other hand. Most of them is in Spanish though, but he knows. And then he also knows how to play dead, which I just taught him. That was the last one that I taught him. Oh, and he also knows how to spin. So he's been doing really, really well. Also the treats that I've been getting, like the high value treats. I will keep you guys updated tomorrow. One of Leo's favorite things to do is play with ice. I give him a little ice cube, but I make sure to rinse it first. Good like puppy thing I found on TikTok because since he's teething, he can bite on it and stuff and it's basically water. We joined the puppy little playgroup class. It was like a one-time class that I signed him up for and it was like $20. Uh, it was super, super fun. Leo had the time of his life. Like I have a great feeling that he's just gonna love the dog parks once I'm able to take him there. In the class, they basically walked us through just like having them play nicely with each other. Um, and if they didn't, they would get like a little timeout. And then also we were making sure that they weren't like overstimulated. The trainer would have us get our puppies focused with the treat and then carry them and hold them for a little bit for them to get a break. And we would let them go and tell them to go play. Where are you barking at? But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the clips of the play group. I'll insert them now. this puppy vlog don't forget to thumbs up subscribe down below if you haven't already and i hope you're having a beautiful day or night we will see you very soon say bye leo say bye say bye